I recorded for Chess Records, uh, with whom my dad was affiliated, and uh, in concert out in the Oakland Arena in California, we had services there, and my very first recording really was Precious Lord Part 1 and Part 2. And um, after that, there were a few things for the Chess label prior to Columbia. And Columbia in 1962, uh, I was brought to the company by by um, uh, John Hammond, forgive me. And um, I did an audition for Mr. Hammond in a little small room, just a little larger than this one, with a piano. And uh, my my manager at the time, Joe King, who took me over to Columbia, my dad, who put. Uh, somewhat put a rhythm section together for me, people that he knew, um, as he and, and uh, uh, our Tatum were very good friends. He would always go and see our Tatum when he would come in town, and our Tatum would come to church when he would come to town and have dinner at our home or something like that. Uh, but anyway, he knew some of the musicians, and so um, he put a saxophone player and uh, he called his friend, he asked him to put the rest of the musicians together. He knew the bass player, but he didn't know anyone else. So anyway, the bass player, Mew Holly, who was rather prominent in those days, put the rhythm section together, actually.